This problem says a 10 foot ladder is resting against a wall and makes an angle of 47 degrees with the ground. Find the height to which the ladder will reach on the wall. Round the two decimal places if necessary. Okay. So here's the wall over here. And here's our ladder. This is our ladder going up like this. And uh, telling us that uh, 10 foot the distance of the ladder uh, makes an angle of 47 that should be a straight line but obviously can't draw very straight makes an uh, angle of 47 degrees with the ground um, find the height to which the ladder will reach on the wall so we're trying to find this uh, value right here so that would be like our variable x now um, this is a right triangle Read uh, around two decimal places. Now, if I draw this without all the extra words and everything, that's 47. This is 10, 10 feet. Now, in terms of this angle, this this side over here is the opposite side. So it looks like I'm trying to find some kind of trig function that ties all of this together. Well, sine is equal to uh, opposite over hypotenuse, cosine is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse, and tangent is equal to opposite over adjacent. Usually the other three aren't actually used for solving uh, word problems like this because these are the only three you have on your calculator anyway that you can access directly. Well, if I look here, okay, this is opposite. This side here that's opposite uh, 90 degrees is our hypotenuse. So it looks like we're looking for a formula that uses opposite and hypotenuse. Well, that's sine. So we're going to work with sine theta is equal to opposite over hypotenuse. Well, they tell us um, that the angle is 47 degrees. So we're going to have sine of 47 degrees is equal to opposite, which we don't know, over hypotenuse, which is 10 feet. Now, we want to get opposite by itself, so we're going to multiply both sides by 10 feet. So 10 feet times sine 47 degrees is equal to opposite over 10 feet times 10 feet. Tens cancel here, the feet cancel. So then our opposite is equal to now I make, need to make sure my calculator is in degrees, so I press my mode, down arrow twice, uh, right arrow, and put my flashing cursor on degree, and press enter. If yours isn't already highlighted, you have to do that. And then second mode, exit out. Okay, so we got 10 times sine of 47 degrees. And then press enter. <coughs> The uh, two decimal places would 7.31. So our answer is 7.31 feet. Now you just enter in 7.31 into the LMS. That'd be how you would input your answer.